Hello everyone. I don't know why I just did that. But um, anyway, I don't know why, but when I filmed this video, I didn't film an introduction. So I'm here now filming this introduction. But anyway, this is how I get the pets ready for when we go on holiday. And I'm out of breath because I just ran up a stairs. Up a stair. Up the stairs. Don't know why I'm out of breath for that, but... Anyway, this is um, how I get the pets ready for the holidays. This is not like the whole thing I do. This is just part of it. This was mainly focusing on Smarty because chocolate has a lot different. He mostly gets prepared like the day I take him. So, but this is how I get them ready. And in this video you'll see now, um, I have different hair because obviously my hair's pink right now. And in this video my hair was like rosy, goldy, blondy sort of colour. I don't know what you would even call it. Orange. Like, it was even orange, so. Just no haters for my hair colour, okay? It's sorted now. This is what it is at. But I hope you like this video and enjoy. So let's get into it. I'm going to start off with uh, sorting Smarty out. So I have to <laughs> transfer Smarty from his big cage into his holiday cage. Because he goes to my friend's house and I just find it easier um, if I like take him in a smaller cage because not many people will have room for this size cage but even though I feel like they should so I'm gonna let me wake Smarty up quickly because I need to wake him up but I'm gonna put him in his carrier which is the rosewood um, small pet pod in the large and I got that one because um, we had a £5 gift card for Argos which we needed to use but so I got it for like £2 something so basically yeah and I have all this to sort out as well but yeah this used to be his carrier which you would have seen in my haul, but I just thought that was way too small for him. So I've got my big one, so I'm going to put Smarty in the carrier and then I'll talk to you. I've now just put Smarty in his carrier, and as you can see, he's right here. As he was sleeping in his strawberry house, um, I left him in there, and you can see the glare of me, so hi there. But, um, yeah, so he's in there. And if you wouldn't wondering why there's cardboard on top of his cages, because when I got Chocolate's new hutch, uh, I had to move Smarty's cage, but where Smarty's cage is now, chocolate kept on jumping on top of it. So we put cardboard on top, so um, he couldn't hurt himself. And if he just had that, there was chocolate in his hutch. So we're going to leave little Smarty in there. And now I'm going to um, probably clean the... Um, Travel cage. Okay, so I've just finished doing this cage. This is what it looks like. And the bedding that I'm using right now, because I don't have enough of like my other bedding, is uh, this bio catlet, which is perfectly safe for hamsters. So he's got that and he's had it before and he's like, he didn't mind it. There's not a deep layer in there because, you know, this cage isn't actually that good for any of that. But anyway, he's got his wheel, which is just the 7 inch fine saucer. And don't worry guys, I am planning on buying him a new one. Either the comfort wheel or the rodent wheel. Or even Trixie's. And then he's got his elephant house. Um, I haven't put any bedding in there yet, but I'm going to do that in a minute. Um, but he never normally sleeps in that one, he kind of just stores his food in that one, so I might not bother. He's then got his board and breaker, rainbow bridge. Um, this, oh, sat in the bag. This weird tile thing that I found at Poundland, but I thought it was too cute to not get. And then he's got his wooden cho toys, yeah, chews, and his whimsy crocodile got his water bowl and food dish and these are just bowls I found in Poundland and he's currently eating ham hammy hamster not hammy hamster, harry hamster and then 
we've got his water bottle in this stand and then right here I'm gonna put his strawberry house so here he is um I've just put bedding from his old cage in here for him and he's good Of course he goes for the food first. Oh, well, maybe not. So, yeah. Okay, so I've just sorted out his big cage for like when he gets back. And I don't know, I've just gone for like a natural sort of theme. Okay, so I'm just about to get um, Smarty's bag ready. Uh, so oh, I've got my carrier bag. This is just a curl up one. So I'm going to stick his food in here and I know this is half empty but it'll last him until Monday because we're only going from Friday till Monday so got that. We then I'm going to take this little bag of mini, it says mini drops berries, they're basically just yoghurt drops but berries. That makes sense, ooh my neighbour's home. So I've got them. Uh, where's the spoon? Got a spoon to do his food and this is just a half a tablespoon so that's how much I feed my hamster a day unless he really doesn't eat it the day before so I don't give him any so he's got a half a teaspoon and then what I will also put in there is his binder that has all of his notes and stuff and also has the instructions that I've written for her. Okay now I've got a little chocolate, it's ran out of bags so I'm going to use Smarty's one because Smarty's going to two roads along. Chocolate is going to like two towns along. So yeah. So what I take for him is his food but I've got to mix that up because these are two different foods and then he will take some treats but I've got to put some treats together because right now oh can I get it out? Can I get it out? Oh shit. sorry guys, I didn't mean to do that. Because right now all of his treats are currently in this one big tub, so I've got to pick a selection of those out for him for holiday and I've also got to get his bowls. So I will talk to you after I get that because they're right at the back of this cupboard. So goodbye. So I've just got my out my 7 litre tub of bowls and I got this from Poundland. Can I even open it? So yeah, this is my bowls, this is just all my hamster bowls. And rabbit bowls together because you know there's not much point in keeping them together. And I've got two more hamster bowls that I need to put in there. So I just put them in right there. And then these right here are the bowls. He takes away with him because they're really good bowls, but I don't like them in his cage because he just throws them around. So when he goes on holiday, he takes these ones. So yeah, I've got those bowls. And then what I think the food is, I'm just going to take this big tub of food instead of two small ones like last time. Because that was too much hassle for all of us. So yeah. So yeah, that's basically what I do for all the pets. And then obviously on the day I take them, I get their carriers ready and like get them all in the car. So yeah, hope you like this video. Don't know why you even needed to see it, but I thought you might like it. So yeah, goodbye. Please like, please subscribe and comment and say what other videos you want to see in the sun in my eyes. Probably see a shadow on my face now. So goodbye. I'll see you guys another day.